Welcome to English Practice Every Day. Phrasal verbs we will learn today are 1. Walk out, walk out. 2. Walk over, walk over. 3. Walk through, walk through. 4. Walk up, walk up. 5. Walk on, walk on. Let's start. Please speak out loud with me. 1. Walk out, walk out. Walk out means to exit or leave a place or situation, often abruptly or in protest. Walk out means to exit or leave a place or situation, often abruptly or in protest. Walk out is often followed by off. Walk out off. Walk out is often followed by off. Walk out off. The audience started to walk out of the boring lecture. The audience started to walk out of the boring lecture. The employees threatened to walk out if their demands weren't met. The employees threatened to walk out if their demands weren't met. Jean couldn't stand the movie's terrible plot, so he walked out of the theater. Jean couldn't stand the movie's terrible plot, so he walked out of the theater. Walk out followed by on. Walk out on. Walk out on means to abandon or leave someone or something often irresponsibly or without warning. Walk out on means to abandon or leave someone or something, often irresponsibly or without warning. Jack walked out on his family when times got tough. Jack walked out on his family when times got tough. The singer walked out on the concert, leaving the audience disappointed. The singer walked out on the concert, leaving the audience disappointed. Mary felt hurt when John walked out on their relationship without explanation. Mary felt hurt when John walked out on their relationship without explanation. Two, walk over, walk over. Walk over means to treat someone with disregard, to take advantage of someone's kindness, or to easily defeat or outperform them. Walk over means to treat someone with disregard, to take advantage of someone's kindness or to easily defeat or outperform them. Don't let others walk over you. Stand up for your rights. Don't let others walk over you. Stand up for your rights. Peter always felt like people walked over him because he was too nice. Peter always felt like people walked over him because he was too nice. In negotiations, it's essential not to allow the other party to walk over you. In negotiations, it's essential not to allow the other party to walk over you. Three, walk through, walk through. Walk through means to guide or explain something to someone in a step-by-step -step manner. Walk through means to guide or explain something to someone in a step-by-step -step manner. Can you please walk me through how to use this software? Can you please walk me through how to use this software?
The instructor walked the students through the experiment before they started. The instructor walked the students through the experiment before they started. He asked his mentor to walk him through the business plan before the presentation. He asked his mentor to walk him through the business plan before the presentation. Four. Walk up. Walk up. Walk up means to approach or move closer to something or someone, often on foot. Walk up means to approach or move closer to something or someone, often on foot. I saw Amy walking up to the podium to accept the award. I saw Amy walking up to the podium to accept the award. They decided to walk up to the hill to enjoy the scenic view. They decided to walk up to the hill to enjoy the scenic view. Eve slowly walked up to her crush and struck up a conversation. Eve slowly walked up to her crush and struck up a conversation. Fayu, walk on, walk on. Walk on means to continue walking, especially in a determined or resolute manner. Walk on means to continue walking, especially in a determined or resolute manner. We need to walk on for another mile to reach the campsite. We need to walk on for another mile to reach the campsite. The hikers were determined to walk on despite the challenging terrain. The hikers were determined to walk on despite the challenging terrain. Even though it was late, we decided to walk on and explore the city further. Even though it was late, we decided to walk on and explore the city further. That's all for this phrasal verb session. Please keep practicing them until the next time when we pick up for you more phrasal verbs and master them. Bye for now.